The pandemic put setting sail on hold over the summer, but some cruise ships are now back, TJ. Can you believe it? The Cruise Lines International Association, that's a group that represents 95% of cruises, made an important announcement allowing ships to operate only if they abide by strict safety protocols for their passengers and the crew members. All right, and joining us now from Naples, Italy, is ABC News foreign correspondent Maggie Ruley with more. And Maggie is on a cruise ship. Maggie, you are on. What? Well, yes, can't believe it. You're on a cruise ship. How in the world is this going? What's it like to be on a cruise ship in the midst of a pandemic? I know, TJ, that's the questions everyone is asking me. You're on a cruise during a pandemic, but believe it or not, it's happening. We woke up this morning in the port of Naples. Mount Vesuvius is peeking up behind the cruise ship. You can see a dance class even going on behind me, which I'm sure you would be a part of, TJ. Uh, but the thing you're also going to see is that everyone out here, they're wearing face masks. And the really big part of the safety protocol that the cruise ships are putting into place that's being tested here on the MSC Grandiosa is universal testing. Uh, so, TJ and Amy, every single person you see behind me, myself included, we have all been tested at least once by the cruise ship before getting onto this uh, ship today. The crew, they've been tested three times and they quarantined. Uh, so right now we're kind of on this massive floating social safe bubble and authorities say that's really the first step to protecting travel, protecting the cruise ship and, and it's working. So uh, we boarded in Genoa about two days ago and we got on, we tested negative, but two people that were trying to board that day with us, they tested positive. So themselves and four of the people that were traveling with them, they all were denied boarding. They could not get on this cruise ship. So that's one way to keep all these passengers safe. They say they can keep up with it. Right now, we're at about 40% capacity. That's roughly, you know, 2,000 people that on board this ship. Again, every single one of them has been tested. And every time people board at every port for every, each night, seven nights long, they will be tested also. It's pretty incredible, guys. Wow. I mean, okay, so everyone's wearing masks. There's obviously testing going on uh, daily. Uh, we know a lot of other safety measures have been put in place, but are we still going to see the same kinds of activities that we normally see on a cruise ship. I mean, I see there everyone's in the pool there. Yeah, I mean, testing is just the first step in this testing protocol. So in addition, I mentioned those face masks. Everyone out here in public areas, they're all wearing face masks. It's mandatory. Social distancing is also mandatory. So you'll notice that the beach chairs are staggered so people don't get too close to each other. Another big question, air ventilation. So on board this ship, it's 100% fresh air. Nothing has been recycled. These are just some of the measures that they are taking to make sure that people can cruise safely during a pandemic. Cruise sa safely. Also, what does this mean for the uh, the industry here in the United States? Uh, could we expect some kind of a comeback? And do people, is there really a market right now for folks wanting to get back on a cruise ship? Yeah, well, TJ, I hate to break it to everyone. Right now, unfortunately, Americans are not allowed on board this ship, and cruising is still blocked along the coast of the U.S. But I want to give you guys some good news. You, too, could also be out here soon. MSC Cruises and the cruise line industry is working with the CDC right now. They're trying uh, to talk to them, to prove to them that, you know, this is a test case. Everyone here has been tested. They've been doing this now for six weeks safely. So they hope that by showing this safety protocol, showing how you can cruise safely, that hopefully soon Americans can get on here get on board as well. Maybe you guys can join me soon. It looks beautiful and look that outdoor dance class. That is right. That's, <laughs> that's my right jam. up TJ's alley. <laughs> right up TJ's alley, Maggie. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.